Walking up this street in the heart of Leicester city centre, at first glance everything is as you'd expect, but when you take a closer look at this building, you might be in for a bit of a shock. From a giant bear to a scampering mouse, Leicestershire artist Shona Richardson has transformed this building into an exhibition space full of her crocheted creations. It's decorated in such a way, or presented in such a way, so that it, it does look a little bit like a house, so you're not actually sure when you're looking in the windows what you're looking at or whether you should be looking in or not. It's been empty for a considerable time, at least two years, probably a lot longer than that. So it was quite uh, sad. But now it's, I think we've restored it to its former glory. Shona isn't the only artist to have found a new way of using an empty space. Over in the city's cultural quarter, the Maker's Yard and Two Queens, an artist's studio, have also taken over former textiles factories. And the city council, who work with landlords to assist artists, say it's a way of breathing life into different parts of the city. What I just remember is it's a cake shop. And I think that is lovely. I mean, because it's still empty for a little while, and I think it's really nice to be being used. Uh, it's a good idea because most people don't really go into the galleries that much, and it's a good idea if it gets people out. It's really entertaining watching people peering into, you know, their, their amazement as they peer through the windows of, of the shop. Shona became famous for her giant crocheted lions, which were toured round the region as part of the 2012 Cultural Olympiads. Now she's hoping this new installation will surprise and delight a few more passers-by. Gita Pensei, BBC East Midlands Today.